Bollinger Motors has revealed the production version of its B1 and B2 classic off-roader styled electric SUVs and they carry a price of US$1,25,000 for the entry-level model. The company is one of the ambitious startups wanting to make a big impact in the world stage with electric propulsion. The brand was established back in 2014 and the B1 concept came to the fore three years later. Compared to the conceptual version, the changes are evident and Bollinger looks to have improved on a number of functional elements along with the design. In the B1 SUV, the B pillar has been moved forwards for easy entry of the occupants and the belt line is moved up as well. The sliding doors are ditched in favor of manual crank units that are said to be lighter as well as robust. The taller windows should allow for better view from the inside as it compensates for the higher belt line. The improved front fascia is claimed to be a breakthrough in thermal dynamics as a smaller radiator has been mounted behind the bumper. This dismissed the requirement for a stack of more radiators for cooling purposes and thus more weight has not been added. This also gave more freedom for engineers to position the headlamps in a wider manner and the LED tail lamps are also moved to the edges at the back for better aesthetic appeal. As you could expect, the production version of the B2 pickup truck has many similarities with the B1 sibling but the obvious changes should not be undermined. The flatbed is now an independent unit from the cab and it will help in commercial purposes. As for the performance, the Bollinger B1 SUV and B2 pickup truck come equipped with two electric motors sending power to all the four wheels. The combined power output stands at 614 horsepower and 906 newton meters of peak torque. It also uses a 142 kilowatt hours capable battery pack. The claimed range on a single charge is more than 322 kilometers and due to the instant performance characteristics generated by the electric powertrain. The 0 to 96 kmph acceleration time is just 4.5 seconds. It will be interesting to see how the duo performs in the international markets as the pricing could be considered on the premium side despite having a lucrative EV range.